Good morning, good morning. Oh, afternoon, good afternoon, good afternoon. And welcome, welcome, welcome to Kudos World. I didn't do the video this morning, but I actually, it's not going outside. So I walked to my happy library, turned my book in, and I did a book haul. So I bought four books. I'm going to tell you what they are. One book that caught my, well, the first book that caught my eye. I'll talk about that in a minute. I saw this book, and really I read it and caught my eyes too. It's a club novel by Mark Bowen. A Texan gun club novel. And it's called The Keys of Redemption. And the cover got me. And I thought this would be a really good book. The situation at Asmo was despite four months of deadly statement for division fought and destroyed it was a battle with no end in sight when a texas gun club went to end zone in a previous roll of the dice the soldiers of the texas gun club took a terrible chance in the last hours of may 1944 in one of the most ambitious moves of World War II. The hard left division breaks in statements and opens the settlement of Rome for Atlanta. Can't wait to read this book. Still again, the lighting is like, oh. but I cannot wait to read that book. Kelly Rumor, before I let you go. I saw, this is the first book I saw when I got in here. I saw that and I was like, I think people have talked about this book. The 2 a.m. phone call is the first time Lexi's daughter has heard her sister's voice in here. Annie is a drug addict, a thief, a liar, and a troubled man. Lexi has always bailed Annie out, given her money and a place to sleep, Send her to even a kind of rehab, but this time she's not strung out. She's pregnant and premature labor. If she goes to the hospital, she loses custody of her baby. Maybe even go to prison, but in effect, it's unlikable. As the weeks unfold, Lexi finds herself paying for her fragile newborn needs while her carefully orderly life is collapsing around her. She's in danger of losing her job and her friend only has so much practice for any drama in court order rehab. Annie attempts to halt her downward spiral and confirm long buried secrets from her sister. Childhood secrets from her sister's childhood. Ghosts that Lexi doesn't want to face, but will the jury feel Annie or lead her down the dark path? Both can be compromised before I let go. Explores the holy device topic and asking how far the lives of the family's love can be stretched before they finally break. Ooh, sounds spooky. <laughs> the next one, I think this is a book series because I have two of them. This one is Shattered. Shattered will keep you. Turning the pages until the very end, it will be on your deepest. Oh, pages will at the very end. It should be on your deepest shelf. So it sounds like this may be a really good book, but could also put me in tears, or it could also put me in like parts where I can't breathe. Let's see here. This is book two. It is a book series, so this is book two. It says, 
when her biological brother returns to Esri, Alaska, is shattered by his artists where numbers of silent makes healing and the vision of the protect him. Gibby Gardner loved the McKinley Lai family, but he also wants to find the truth and he knows those closest to you have the power to deserve you most. With his shovel punishing for quick, cursing and expected leaves, like all his illusions and publishing the truth, Landon's career is in jeopardy. When Piper punches, launches her own investigations, Landon realizes he must protect her from herself and from whatever complications await as the two fall loose to deep Canada. Reaching black country, not only does their long friendship seem to be running into something more, but the dangerous causes become dealer with each step. Shattered is a masterful story that Blend supposedly direct characters into what ill tales that keep the reader turning the pages and begging for more. And this is by Dina Perte. Okay. The next one, let's see what this is. This is book four in the series, and it's called Silence. So, a recently day of rock climbing takes a disturbing turn. When Keelan, when Caden McKenzie Root brings her face to face with dead climber, there's trouble. Accident and something darker when she, when the case is hunted to overbound Sheriff London. Ginger and turns to Jake Weston for help. With Jake's past now rent, he's ready to use his talent for investigations again. But he could never prepare for where the mystery will take him. Galen's climbing opportunities move with Jake realizes that each death was no accident. And worse, it seems the killer is onto them. When strange things begin happening to Yancey, Jake is terrified that once again his will may put someone he loves in danger. But the truth is far worse than he can imagine. So, those sound like really really good books and I would love to get book one and read it because I have book two and I have book four I would definitely like to find the rest of these books and I'd like to have that book series hope you enjoyed this video and until next time